Oh yeah, I just boot in for the steamers. But I basically figured it out. Hey, what's up guys, it's your brother Raymond X and today we have another video where I have getting a Steam Deck SSD upgrade to 256 gigs. I took out my 64 gig SSD, which is trash. I've been trying all day to get this thing to just like boot SteamOS onto an SD card and no luck, that has not been working out for me. It just doesn't want to write. I don't know. Maybe I have to use a different SD card. But I don't want to use my 256 gig SD card because it has Windows on it. So yeah, we have this one. I got this from Alpha Amazon. Looks really nice compared to the original, which looks pretty basic. In the future, again, I will try to get one terabyte or 512. Or maybe I'll just get a bigger SD card instead of my 256 gigabyte SD card, which you guys seen in my other videos on shorts. So we're gonna put this in. Now, this was advertised and on Amazon, same for the Steam Deck, which I did my research definitely. So, so I put Steam OS on it. So. Now, I'm just using that. I'm gonna have to reinstall Windows. I need again and do dual boot all that. So now, this is the way it comes up. So now we're gonna click on where it says Free Image Steam Deck. So it's gonna put it on the internal SSD. But yeah, guys, please ensure you guys take out the SD card because. I was gonna buy a new SD card regardless, but... Okay, so I think I might have clicked the wrong settings. I clicked on re-image Steam Deck. I think it's the correct settings. Now it is rebooting. So hopefully it's gonna boot up now off the internal SSD for 256 gigs. And um, yeah, it's doing its thing. You can hear the fans kicking up. I'm definitely gonna order a new custom back for the Steam Deck because I did kind of somewhat mess up my old back and I'm gonna put on a skin on this. I've just ordered a Cyberpunk skin. It says it's coming tomorrow but there is a snowstorm so I hope I see it tomorrow. I got my SSD. I ordered it yesterday and I got it today so that was pretty cool. Okay so it looks like yes we now have SteamOS set up again. Let's this time on the internal memory. Let's go to about and see what's it saying. Ram size, blah blah blah. I want to see the internal memory. Anyways, I'm going to set this up for you guys and then I'll be back. Okay, so now we have SteamOS installed on the internal memory and ssd i mean on the ssd internal memory same thing you guys can see now um now i'm just trying to get some stuff back because everything is gone all those games you can see steam library they're not even installed i'm installing by gta 4 so my internal storage you guys can see right there so we have 256 gigs and then this is the sd okay guys so now we have dual boot on the Steam Deck, I have officially done it, dual boot. So, once I restart the Steam Deck, just restart it, it gives you 15 seconds to dual boot. Yes, restart. As you guys can see, I also did a lot of themes, so my Steam Deck looks pretty neat and unique. Just get this thing that I want to focus. Aperture lock. So once I hit restart, I believe this should also work with Windows as well. It should boot into this menu. You guys can see, so we have the option.